Here's a really useful tool that I never knew existed until I watched a recent tutorial from Andrew Price or Blender Guru as you might know him. And I thought it was really worth sharing with you all in case you haven't seen it. So I'm in the basic scene, I'll delete the default cube and add in a plane. So Shift A to add, mesh and then plane. I'll zoom in on that, go to edit mode with tab and I'll go to edge mode just here. So if I select one edge such as this one here, hopefully most of you know that you can press G twice, so GG for edge slide. And that's a really useful command in itself because I'm constrained to the edges of this plane. But it does clamp when I hit the edge here. Now you can see any controls up the top left here when you start using a tool and you haven't applied it. And you can see there's an option there for clamp with C. So if I press C now, I can actually go beyond the original edge. And that's really, really useful. For example, I'll undo that and I'll do a loop cut down the middle. So Control R, do a loop cut down the middle, double left click and G to grab in the Z axis. So we've got a simple roof here. I'll just quickly put in the base of the house. So I'll go back to the simple roof, back into edit mode. And of course I want my roof to overlap the house. Well, I can just press GG to edge slide like this and then C to turn the clamp off. And now I can overlap it like that. What a handy trick. Thank you, Andrew Price. And thank you for watching. See you next time.